what was it that you said? Enter autumn. Enter autumn. Enter autumn. You never thought it was fine in Alberta. And here we are. Gonna start tossing parts on it. Start building the clubman out of it. Make it look like it should. Oh, that's a nice square fender. It's gonna be a real sweetheart. Quality part. British Motor Heritage. The genuine stuff. Uh, it's tell me a story here. What, what's going on? Clubman uh, Estate, man. Clubman Estate. Need right I here. say more? 74. Holy this shit, look at this good. tire right here, Michelin. This thing is good. I know. And and uh, like you bought some minis, but I've never seen one of these. I always buy junk. This is <laughs> real. So do we all. I love these panels. Isn't that nice? Oh, they're raised. Oh, that makes a little more sense. Yeah. Oh, may I? Sure. Yeah. Ooh. No. I know, like, right? Holy. Uh, look at the floors, dude. Well, look at the, look at all floor. of this. Oh, are that. you kidding me? Oh man, this was calling your name from space, eh? Like, you are the right guy for this. This is beautiful. Is that a Clubman instrument cluster? Yeah, is that a little off different? To the side instead of the middle. Okay. That's probably the miles, eh? 42? Yeah, I think so. Seems reasonable. Yeah, absolutely. Holy, it's not even mousy or gross or, or nothing. No. no. Was it inside? He started inside since 84. Holy sh! look at the floors. I know. Oh man. Yeah, you probably looked at this for what? And the eight back seat floors are even on. just as good as the front floors. Like, There's even tin. Yeah. Is that Clubman tin? Yeah. Oh man, I, I uh, man, we should get some vice grips and mock it up. <laughs> That's awesome. It's fucking sweet. There's a fiberglass front end there. Did they even up. bring these to Canada? No. I've never seen a no, they uh, never Clubman brought estate. Clubman's to North America. And it's got the original wheels. I love the back doors. Yeah. And this here? That's from Europe. I think it's Ger I think it came from Germany. Oh man, is that ever cool? The doors, look at the doors are good. Mm -hmm. They're really good. Yeah. Look at all this. Yeah, it's perfect. You'd expect that all to be just poo. Yeah. You would. Wow. Oh man. <laughs> Even the top is clean. Mm-hmm. The split bumper. Yeah. And it's Clubman because it's got the square edges. Clubman bumpers have these square edges. Normal ones are like rounded. Oh okay. So they're different. So it's not just like typical van bumper, it's right. Clubman it's van different. bumper. You towed it back with the van, so that was a good idea. Well yeah. it was van day. It was van day. Might as well tow this van with a van. That's uh, sweet. So this is where it was binged. I guess. Yeah. Yeah, that's not bad. Not bad at all. A panels and front sheet metal on it. Shit, you'll be driving this thing. It's sweet. It's sweet. It runs and drives right now. That drove us really? on here. Yeah, oh, of that is so cool. Yeah. Turn like it's key. running. Yeah. Oh, well, I guess because the rad's on the side. Mm hmm And nine 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 eight. Yeah. Yep. And uh, a single SU. Yep. Standard trim 998. Because these cars did tend to rust, didn't oh, they? Yeah. Like, they got fucked up pretty good. And how was the subframes? Perfect. Yeah, like under the back, like when you get under there and look, it's so nice back there. I guess what's what's looking? You now you're looking for a grill and front bumper kind of thing. And that's and some of the trim. Yeah, grill bumper trim pieces. Those are the Clubman specific stuff that I need. Yeah, yeah. and a driver's seat. Oh, okay. And that's Clubman specific. Is this a mini seat? Or yeah, is this... that's a standard round nose like uh, Mark oh, okay. III seat. Yeah. Yeah. So that's like what should be in my car. So is there a shelf that goes in there? Yeah, there's all the liners and pieces. I've got all the interior stuff here. Oh, it has it all. Oh, okay. Look at how, I think the color is just magic. Yeah. Is it like it's an orange, eh? It's, yeah, it's, uh, it's a very pale orange. Oh, so this is what they were uh, going to do, is put a glass front in well, What's me. What's that I see there? Headliner. Yeah, two-piece headliner. For the mini? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh. You guys are rock stars. 
stars, man. This is so What do you cool. think, I've never Dean? Seen... Give it the Dean review. I've never seen anything like it in my life. No, I've never seen one I've either. never seen one like this. No, I've like... seen a lot of cars, and I've Wait. never... Dave, you ever seen a Mini I've Clubman? I've never seen a... I've, I've, you know, I've seen the little station wagons, the Countryman's, but yeah. nothing like this. Nothing like this. This is really, really cool. Yeah. How many Minis does this make? I don't know. Too many. Yeah. too many. Too many. Too many minis. Too many minis. Oh, the many. Rat, this is special. not too many, but many. This is special. It's many many minis. Yeah, this is Somebody special. This is. is. Oh, this is a thing. fixer. Yeah. <laughs> so I got oh, this yeah. for Trev. Yeah. This is Trev. Oh, this is Trev. Yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. And all I can think about is Trev sitting <laughs> back here yeah. with his head out this side window, loving life. Well, I didn't even know. I didn't even know these existed. Like with the wood paneling, that's just crazy. Oh no. At least you won't have to spend a ton on the actual wood paneling. Yeah, just stickers. He just one uh, yeah, one roll, one roll, and you can just cut it into slices and yeah. do the whole thing. Is this specific to this body style? That's specific to vans and pickups. Yeah, okay. Oh, like the, the pickup pick has, pick has it too. Panel mm -hmm. van has it. How pick much longer is the wheelbase on these? I think they're like yeah, ten yeah, to twelve yeah, inches long. Yeah, yeah, it is a lot longer. Yeah. Just in here? There and behind. If you look longer. at the floor pan, you can see it's the standard floor pan, but they added another piece. Oh, so they've it. lengthened the... You can the... see where the join is. Oh, yeah. There's that lengthening piece. Okay. And these are sliders? Yeah, just that front pane slides and that's back. that's glass. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Oh, is that ever beautiful? Yeah. Look at it, it's even... Yeah. Oh, man. It's good. Yeah, you're the right owner. It's good. This. Yeah. You're absolutely it's a right good right thing. It's a yeah. good thing. It's so clean. Oh man, damage doesn't matter. Like, there's a dent in the door. Who cares? So there's a nice cool. gash here. That's a sweet piece of damage. Little bit of damage. Damage cam. <laughs> but look at how good the friggin' exhaust is. Do you need a battery? Can we start it up? It needs a boost. There's a battery in it. It'll fire right up with a boost. Oh yeah. Hang on. Well, I don't know if it'll go, but try it. That is a that's absolutely. Why the, that's why the right first move is degreasing. Yeah, yeah. Because it's like, fuck, it's great. Yeah, no, like wash it off and tune it up. It seems a little choky. Oh, it's running red. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it needs, it needs like tuning. Tune up, but it doesn't need. Like it's fundamentally really good. The gearbox is good, clutch is good. Really? Dangerous new trend buying decent cars. Weird, right? <laughs> when the lights come on? I don't know. I never tried any of that. Oh, you got something there, yeah. Running lights. Really? Yeah. Check the headlights. The headlights don't seem to be working. <laughs> See this? What? Oh, it's got the deluxe ash receiver. That's cute as hell. What a sweet car. Ah. Oh man. Well, it's gonna be, I think it's jumping to the front of the queue. Oh, it is. <laughs> Without much thought, what's here is gonna be here. Yeah. And then it gets put on is I'm either gonna shoot for color match or I'm gonna shoot for just like painted yep. something. I'd probably oh, it's so good. I'd probably shoot the match. same color. I it's a nice thing. Make. It's so good. Yeah, it is. Like this will polish. And that's why it needs right? to be Maybe. polished because yeah. then you can fucking match. Yeah. And no, it, it is. It's polish. too good to do all of it right and now. And you could PDR most of this. Yeah. Just yeah. tap tap and. Yeah. It's just been shoved in in here. This is all cut. Oh. This is part of the fender. And this you can see oh. how they mangled everything, getting it all apart. Oh, okay. Yeah. They did a shit yeah, job tearing it Can you get in that? No, it's boxed off. So you have to pull it out. Yeah. No, that's okay. Whatever. It's all uh, and inner wings are different than... Yep, different. Because they step the... out. See how they like step over? And come wider. Because the hood's wider. Oh, because the, the, the fenders are very thin. The fenders are skinny. Yeah, they don't have the big round fender. Yeah, and the hood stays flat like this. And then... Instead of coming down like yeah, a normal Yeah, yeah, okay. 
So what was the purpose of the seat. of the clubman? Was it just the to clubman, modernize it? The clubman, just to they, bring they it were, up to they date. They were looking to, to phase out the round nose with the clubman. Like, right. It was to be like the new face. Right. And they came out in '69, like 10 years after Minis came out. Oh, right. And, and then. Uh, and then people just kind of. Yeah. Well, they, they wanted they, both. People liked the round nose better. Mm -hmm. Like they still they sold the round nose at the same time. I yeah. think probably because they had so many leftover panels. Sure. Too. Sure. And then and the round nose. They were hedging outsold. their bed a bit, maybe too. It always outsold it, so. Yeah. Oh, so what years did they make these? Sixty nine uh, to, to 80. seventy. Oh, okay. So it wasn't ten years. I mean, they still made a few. Mm -hmm. So this so is going to be hard to find. Any any of the stuff here that you see missing, I don't have. Like I don't have. Okay. The trim so for the quarter or yeah. the front end trim, I don't have. Should be able to. So you're going to gyms to wash this, and then what? Push it off, or? Yeah, I get it off and yeah. whatever. If I get to wash them, that's cool. If not, I'll do it tomorrow. Yeah. Well, it's even better than I than I ever thought. Oh, like, yeah. yeah it's no. crazy. Right on. Yeah, Keith. it's awesome. Yeah, I love it. Yeah. All right. Well played. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, very cool. To, There's uh, one guy for this uh, car. Yeah. This is the guy. <laughs> yeah. But left hand drive, which is awesome. Yeah, dude. wild, right? How yeah. Many, like, they must have come from here? Europe, eh? Yeah. Not many. None, dude. They would have had to be imported. We're wagon towing the car. Yeah, yeah. Love that. <laughs> we'll come and see you later. Bro. See you there we go. Oh, that's cool. That's the sponsor. <laughs> Marshall oh. Farm Equipment, Fred Marshall. Oh. Fuck. That it's an old race car. Cool. It's a race car. I love it's it. It's way more of a car than I thought it would be, honestly. Oh, it's like 100% complete. I thought this was like a scrap little. Oh, the other oh, one's a little less complete. Holy cow, though. It's cool, hey. When was this last run? In like, the mid 50s. Man, you <laughs> Holy. You, man. It's just a time capsule. Oh, yeah, this is so yeah. cool. You can't do anything to it, eh? Over. Yeah, I'll just get oh. it running. Oh, look at all this. It's got this link. You can oh, set this, I, you can pull it down. Can we get another one for me? I got a 37 Ford two-door. It just needs a motor and transmission. It's identical, except it's a sedan. Oh, I want to race them. Oh. I like the chain link fence. Hey. Yeah. yeah. That's <laughs> fucking so It's got a Buick so steering wheel. Cool. <laughs> I have never seen one of these up close. Honest to God, I'm just... I fucking bad. love it. Yeah. And I'm just trying to see how they were made. I'm just they like, cut, how they, much of it is they there? They took the rivets off, of and then they widened. They pushed all this out. See the rivets where this wheel oh, is yeah, yeah. welded in? Yeah, it's all gas welded. Look at this. All you see, you don't lock wheels. It's low, like super oh. low. It's got a third link on the frame. <laughs> but yeah. It's got split wishbones, and yeah, then yeah. it's got this link. Yeah, I was going to say, there's a ton you of extra work here. You can tie down this side of the car to make it, you know, you can set it oh. so it's always So you got stagger. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Man, you and then it's got like a so huge cool. rad in it. Ooh, oh, that's huge cool. rad. Man, you yeah, because how, how did you find it? Where does it end? But he bought it so years stock, ago. Oh, so this is all yeah, they in added front. This crap. So that, uh, that is I, what I was And then he, I said, if you ever sell it, let me know. And then he sold it. And I bought it years, like three years so ago. So what's, do you think the rad's like a big Cadillac that's, or something? It's not a big truck, Ford truck. Like okay, Ford yeah. pickup or something. I'm glad you got it, man. Yeah, I'm fixing it. Oh, it's so cool. I got to see the other side. Don't they have one side cut out to get it out Yeah, the other side's all cut out to get it out Just what I thought the greasy flipper It's got this cool. Oh, man. Oh no! It's so <laughs> low quality. I mean, that's right. We're not. This isn't top gear. It's pretty low quality car. Yeah, it's it's low, I think this, this, the lighting is spooky and awesome. I hope the lights. What is the seat? Is that of an airplane? I'm not 100 percent sure. Airplane seat, bomber seat. <laughs> oh. All right, Grandpa. Yep. Jesus. There you go, you're in. So, <laughs> so check this out. Okay, they bent the steering column over. The clutch is in the middle. The what? brake hangs on the side. Look, they made a hanging pedal. Here, yeah, okay. That's the brake. Yeah. And what? Oh, okay, so they've just yeah, moved they've the moved, cylinder. Yeah, they put a massive cylinder up top there. Is this from a... I don't know what it's from. It's all made. Is it? And then the clutch is in the center because it just hooks to the... And, and then what? you race in second gear all the time, so check this out. Lock it into uh, into that hook. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, so you just hold her down and... Yeah, you're all in second. 
And there's your starter side. Oh, look at AJ. Yeah, just pipes. <laughs> yeah, he just cut it's holes. so and... awful. Oh my god, eh? And so they've cut. They've a bunch cut the of this whole away. inside structure. And the dash, Jesus everything's gone. Christ, but yeah, that's. It would be fun to get it going, eh? So insane. <laughs> So, okay, so stock frame, and then the cage is We've kind just of just... welded it right to the pipes, right, right, to, to, the, the right to the frame. Right to the frame, yeah. And then, it's like your typical early 1950s stock yeah, car. No, right? it's cool to see. It's like, this is really... I like the gas it's still pedal. A, like look it's, at the, it's a stock frame. It's like made. It's all... Look at, there, it, look at it's hooked up over there, and you're... Yeah, that's... <laughs> okay. Yeah. Wow, this, you imagine how hellish it would be, oh, be a ride. to drive this? Yeah, well, I'm excited, yeah. Oh man, after those weak, uh, weak sauce teas, eh? <laughs> Yeah, well this is what replaced them. So. Yeah, just, bah, bah. <laughs> this is going to be nuts. Yeah, it should be So what fun. does it weigh? I don't know, Probably not much. Five. Yeah, probably. And is that a, what do we know about the motor? Uh, it looks like it's a truck motor, like. God. Like, I just love, like look at this here, it's cool. It's like so. The master cylinder and everything. It's brutal, eh? It's so it's brutal. Yeah. It's yeah, just. Cool. I don't know what happened. Yeah, actually, I think we owe it to ourselves. Dave, you should sit in it. No, like, it's pretty if cool, you've yeah. never sat in something that's just like yeah. screaming death, <laughs> it's like, it's the most yeah. death yeah. thing Go you've die. ever sat in. Is Last it? Yeah. Yeah. You should bring oh. it and show the guys on Tuesday, man. Yeah, I could take it down oh, to the Oh, dude. Right? <laughs> yes. I wish I'd get it running. I should. It should, it should run. So I just have to, uh, it turns right over. Oh man, look at this hand lettering, you see it? Oh, it's beautiful, I know, yeah. Oh, look at, this is the stuff. Look at that. That's cool. Is that, and that's just freehand. There's no yeah. masking. Look no. at beautiful, yeah. eh? Even this. Must have been old sign. All just. It, yeah. <laughs> and it's a coupe, which makes it, it's it, cool. Like, you know, they've tried to paint over this. Yeah, they at did. At some point. Yeah, the same as this. And it says this. something. It Henry, says Rowley. Henry or Rowley, okay. Yeah. The drivers. Yeah, even that. Look at it. The drivers Beautiful. are Dick and Ralph. Well, I can't quite make that out. Cereal? Cereal? I'll have to look it up. I'm not look at these. Yeah. yeah, see how that's done? They oh, knock the rivets out and then they just kick the wheel. Sure. Yeah, oh, like okay. That. For offset but no wider? Or just, they're just offset. They're just offset out, yeah. Both of the back ones. Oh. That's a piece of. That's your firewall, fire, I guess. Firewall, yeah. <laughs> kind of, eh? But this is cool, this push thing here. Like, what? It's just Easy, crazy how yeah. cool and original it is, yeah. But, and, and then in some ways you look at it, you're like, damn, you know, this is It was a good car, I know, I know. Yeah, like, I know. It's crazy, like, you see... But it's like a dark the principles are the same. It just got the better black. at it. Well, it's yeah. just like this is. Like but the it's, these are dirt cars, cars, right? This these is are, the first stock cars. These are dirt. Yeah, like the all dirt. Guys. Yeah, you this was cool. Normal people. Like the so, when was this built? That first building Probably of stock Probably in the early cars. 50s. I can't say for sure because maybe Southern Alberta was different. But here they got they were paved track by '54. Right, so, so we know that this was not raised really very far into the 50s. No, it's like, it's like a moment in time, this car. This, yeah, so This cool. car is like from 1950 to 53 or more. Cutting edge at the time. All right, we are back at the GCFCE, and uh, we have some cats, and uh, Dan has been shopping. Let's have a look. Looks like Dan has bought a model of an F4 Phantom. Probably one of the greatest hood ornaments of, of the day. These uh, classic tires are worth the price of admission on this baby. 
Look at those classic Goodyear triple pinstripes. It's like you've been antique auto shopping. Oh, oh the kitty well is in good shape. Yeah, the kitty well is in the, mint condition. The kitty hey. holder is perfect. <laughs> yes, <Yeah, it's> perfect. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, Dan just pointed yeah. out. I don't know if we can see it here. You can just about, maybe not on the camera. You sure e that's an A? a? Yeah, it's definitely an A because there's a, it's a line with a capital A. It just says daily. If it's yeah, it just says daily. Yeah. But there's a daily California. So that's that's where this car is. And you heard it was from California, right? Well, that's what I said. Well, yeah, Matt said it was from California. So. Look at the trunk floor. I know. What's it looking like? That's as good as a picture of California in the glove box. Look at the trunk floor. I know. Like. Even if the rest of the car is poo, that trunk look at floor. That. I awesome. know it's awesome. Yeah, the trunk floor museum. Yeah. Right we already there. got the mat for it. Uh, so it looks really good, right? Like, because I know you were shopping for a '54 Ford convertible. No, yeah. <laughs> like the day before, I'm like, I'm buying, <laughs> buying Paul and I were buying this car. Like, if we're buying a Can car, I get in. Yeah. <laughs> Taxi. Cool, eh? Yeah. Cuban taxi, hey? That's exactly what this is. None of this is frozen up? Nope. The brakes even actually have pedals still. Really? Yeah. We were shocked. Dave and was shocked. So you it started it. Yeah, the car. Um, there's a Paul bought a new 6 volt battery for the thing so we can move it around. This was cool, hey? This decal from 19, what was it say, 1966? Really? Hey, some US Navy yeah. sticker. You know? Well, not completely clock. fucked, right? Loaded. Loaded with features like clock, <laughs> radio. Yeah, so heater. Have you tried moving the top down? Oh, this is fucking seized tighter than a dry. I didn't want to break it. Yeah. Yeah. Can you roll it down? Shit, they actually work. Oh That's my God. Fucked up. Okay, I'm gonna lube every single hinge here real quick. Yeah, okay, great. Let's do it. So Does this handle door handle, handle work? Yeah, door handle works fine. I'm not sure. Oh yeah, there we go. I just don't like pushing on stuff. So we've got a, what, 292? Um, what wide block is this? Be 292, no? The engine was changed to a later engine because the yeah. original engine was still at the auction. Yeah, but well, this might be a 312. It could be a 312. Okay. I'd have to ask Matt what it is because I yeah. really, I couldn't No, I don't know, without looking at it. But if you look, at it, it, if you sure look somebody... at it though, let me grab a flashlight. Oh, yeah. right? But like, it looks like it's been, Reconditioned a, at least, yeah. yeah. At one point in time, it was taken apart. Yep. Um, you can see they wrote the compression test on Ju June 30th of 2020 on there. 120, 120, 140, 145. So it might be a little bit weak. No, that's fine. That's yeah. all they ever would have been. Hey, Ron's okay. Yeah, good. Uh, well, battery's hooked up. Let's yeah. see. Yeah. Cool. Cat. Come here. Come here. Oh, you're so dumb. Oh, something's there. That's the top. There's a solenoid that's not... Here, let me go back there. Okay, we've got the back seat out of the Ford. Let's see. So there's your... I bet you this is a reservoir here. And there's your pump motor. And there is the relay with the signal wires going up to the okay. dash. So Power. hit it. Yeah. Power on. Yeah. Go. Gonna be more than 30 seconds to get the roof to go down so we're gonna leave that for a uh, fun little project here this winter i hope yes yeah those are this winter thing yeah. well i think i get to the bel air first then i'll get to this but oh, yeah 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 no why would you want to work on a sweet convertible when you can work on an ex-government uh station wagon you could pull the entire top mechanism out it's all self-contained right like if you could pull it all out and still leave everything and you could build, you could test it on a bench before you ever put it back in the car. Like you just pull these pins, pull the pins that are at the bottom here. See these, yep. pull, pull those, there's a cotter key in them. Pull the whole, th this is just sitting here. A couple of screws there and there. You can pull everything out and then you could just run six volts to the solenoid and then one, two, this is a ground. Run that to your, you know, you could bench test the whole thing before it ever went in. Paul, this thing can be all bench tested, hey? Oh, that's cool. You know, it's all in perfect condition. Like, there's no damage. It's probably only been up and down 10 times in its whole life. Like, look at the quality of all those parts, these huge forgings. Hey, those and are they're nice. they're all fucked. No, the whole yeah. car is really good. Fuck me. Look at it's not even a 10 year welding fucking jail sentence. Oh. Dan, did you show him the deck that was on the front? 
Oh, um, Scott, you guys see this deck on the fender? Or, uh, it doesn't look like anything. Looks like a piece of tape. This? Yeah. Paul will show you what it actually says. Oh, I now gotta fucking look for it. I have no idea. The other one for it. It looks like a scratch. No, it's, uh, it's not a scratch. You can see equipment. This here, the little car guy right there with, uh... Oh, Offenhauser. Yeah. yeah, and you can see it says finest on the top if you look really close. Yeah, yeah. Right? That's what that I mean. is... I never would have You can see how it says, though, if you look really close, That's precision cool. engineered yeah. speed equipment, right? Yeah. So, like, white pinstriping, Offenhauser decals. Yeah, right. Dummy spotlights. Dummy right? spots, yeah. Went right through the... Leopard uh, kick panels. This is a little different than your usual fare, you guys. Hey. Yeah, this was yeah, a couple too many. This isn't many, even a police car at any level. A couple too many options. It has a radio. And yeah, and right. That. I don't know. I've never seen one of these cars where the top folds up. I don't know what's going on with that. Yeah, that's weird. That's right? kind of weird. It's not very. Need a fast car with no tops. That's yeah. not very base. No, this is like the opposite of base. <laughs> it's the opposite of base. If only you'd be like, yeah, you know, whatever. First, I got to get my Bel Air wagon done. Well, how are you gonna pick up parts of the car with well, okay. You know. Yeah. I guess you could put the top down and put like lumber out the front seat and stuff. Shit, if it was a tiny bit better, you could just wash it up and drive it. Like, it's so good. It'd have to be a, just a touch better. Just yeah. a touch. Well, I mean, I think you spend a winter on this. Not necessarily this winter, but you spend one winter on this thing, polishing and fixing. And I mean, you can't drive with a dent in it and shit. Like, no. But. Well. <laughs> I mean, you could. Yeah, one winter you'd get this car in nice shape. Yep. Yep. Because if you're doing it, like, let's pop the dents out of the grill and, you know, like, you could make, I don't mean just barely, barely presentable, but I mean, like, people would be like, wow, that thing is fucking cool and nice. Yeah. Because it's such a good starting point. Could you imagine rolling up a golf course in this, though? I can imagine very well rolling right. up anywhere with this. Automatic, right? So it's an estate car. The, the other thing is we never even looked at it before we bought it. Huh? We never even looked at it. Oh, you didn't? Nope. Impulse purchase. Impulse purchase, yeah. Oh, you bought it online? Yeah. Paul and Dan had to work with the old trigger finger. Hey? Oh, funny. Yeah. Well, if Matt was bidding on it, it means it was a decent car, so. <laughs> yeah, for sure. That's all I can think That's of. That's like, oh, okay, well. The only decent car at the whole auction, and three of my friends are bidding on it, yeah. unknown to each other. Yeah. This is what we were talking about with Matt and Jim yesterday. There's a big difference between a car that looks okay and one that's actually usable and good. And that's all the stuff, right? Yeah. Like it doesn't matter. It doesn't have to look any better than this. It just has to hold. All that shit has to work. Yeah. Sunliner. That's cool. Probably the same car with a W. Sunliner. Yeah, that's sweet, hey? Yeah. 54 is kind of a weird orphan year, too. You know, you get the first Y block with the old body. Yeah. Because it's a U.S. car? Yeah. Yeah. Well, just because they wanted to have the Y block ready for 53, but it wasn't ready yet. What are you going to put on this when it's done? What's wrong with the turret? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, of course. Why um, would you? I think, I think it needs wide whites, doesn't it? I, I think so. It's kind of a wide whites car, yeah. Yeah. Like, this isn't really a Craig or SS car. It's I think like the happens. dishes are cool. They're, that's really base, yeah. Really, like really. Convertible with dishes? That's cool. Really church it up with like an 05 Taurus bucket. Right. Power on one side. Yeah, power on one side. Yeah. And then you have to disconnect it because it can't. Whatever replace you it. don't paint it if these cats are just going to live on it. Yeah. Do you just want to paint anything now? No. See, it's a perfect paint. excuse. Yeah. I can't paint it. Fuck the cats. Yeah. On one word car reviews, uh, Mo car reviews with Laura, avec Laura. Uh, 1971 Safari. How do your cars have such long names, Scott? DS21 DS21 Safari. Safari Wagon. French for wagon is brake. Brake? B R E A K. Brake. Just come on with us. Allons-y, avec nous. Oui. Oui. Oh, uh, I'm sitting in the driver's I guess seat. you're driving. I'm driving. We have the most important Citroën accessory with us. It's a bad poodle. It's a French poodle. 
Okay, so first thing you have to do is put on your belt to safety. Oh! Right, so it has, good, it eh? does not move, so. No. So we're just. You just, yeah, just as long as you don't need to use any of the controls on the dashboard, you're okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. So, uh, it's four on the column, and that's about all you need to know. That's it? That's it. That's all you need to know. Let me get the, come on, focus, you fuck. Uh, there's the infamous Citroën mushroom, Le Champignon. Le Champignon. There you go. So, oui. if you get in a situation, just uh, frappe Le Champignon. <laughs> <laughs> Slap the mushroom. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds so dirty. That's a very tiny accelerator pedal, too. It is. It, it offers proportionally <laughs> tiny acceleration. All right. Uh, okay, so okay. turn the key like clockwise, your... as one does, till a bunch of lights come on. Then push the button on the side of the column, and yes. slowly push the gas down as you push it, yeah. Whoa. Give her a little bit. There you go. Ready? Okay. Now she should start to come up. That's there you fun. go. That's fun, hey. There's the that's the height control. You see the white one on the floor there. Yeah, yeah. Is yeah. there a sport mode? Which one's the most French? I can't reach it. That's it. Oh, I know. That's just one of the features of the car. It's five like, lines coming out of a T. Well, it's not really, it's like a factory that's upside down. It's like, no, it's a spaceship. It, this is either the death ray or we actually suck people up with that. Oh, close. Like a tractor beam. Tractor beam, exactly. And away you go. Okay, and... Donnez le. <laughs> <laughs> Let's try out the little champignon. There it is. There it is. Alright. I guess a lot of these got rear-ended on the way home from the dealership because the people had no idea how strong the brakes that's were. Fourth. Oh, that's fourth. There, there we go. go. Is that second? Woo! There, that's better. <laughs> okay, so my first... What the hell is this? Okay, we'll talk what? about that later. This It's like picture book. Oh, the big... Is that the, is that the big wheel of warnings? That's the wheel of warnings, yeah. <laughs> It oh is my cool. god, all these things could go wrong. Yeah. You notice yeah. the one in the middle. Yeah. Stop. Stop. Yeah. Now. That's like, vision. if you're in an airplane, that's the master hydro warning. <laughs> that's the wings are falling that's off. That's the wings are falling off warning. Stop yeah. Stop now. All the instruments are in French except the one that says stop. There we I go. guess they figured they didn't want any ambiguity. You can go right if you prefer. How do you like the brakes? Pretty the good. Brakes are they're, they're really good. Pretty nice, actually. You got her figured out. I got it figured out. It's easier to drive than the Fraser. Anything is easier to drive than the Fraser. Oh, that's fourth. See? <laughs> Still. The Fraser doesn't have fourth, obviously. No. Or synchros. Yeah. Kind of like having a badly fitting bra right now, actually. I'm not going to lie. It's, it's, uh, I can just do one of these when I need to reach stuff, uh -huh. right? Yeah. And then just pop her back on. There. Yeah. What I've noticed first is that it's like the French said that's fourth is it fourth no, go. no we're inside see I'm all twitchy now anyway the French were like we do not want any of your silly ideas about how to put a car together nothing in here is like any other car I've ever been in yeah like none of the buttons look the no, same no nothing no the wheel of warnings is different the wheel of wheel of excitement over yeah. there on the left yeah. yeah it's like you spin it yeah oh yeah wait definitely yeah that's this is right. a do I not like, pull out in front of people i know people see that i get used to my car and i'm like oh, oh yeah no, you know, no 320 horsepower that. with yeah. turbos on both this ends has and, uh, 105 and not self-canceling signals and the signals do not cancel 
and that's not because it's broken. It's just because it's They're just like, you know what, like, we want self-leveling suspension and we want all these amazing things, but we don't care if the signals cancel. Question. Yeah. When the speedometer says I'm doing 80, yeah. am I actually doing 80? Uh, yeah, pretty much. Uh, is it, it's yeah. not like No, it's not French, like the other one, no. French speed? No, it right? actually is pretty close, yeah. Okay, because every other one you're like, yeah, take the speed. Yeah, multiply by, by, by the point seven of, and yeah. yeah, no. No, this one actually pretty close. It's lovely to drive. They are, it's, right? It's a beautiful car. It's, um there's some weird Weirdness. Weirdness, you know? Definitely. I'm, I'm not getting a, an angry vibe from the car at all. I'm getting kind of like Yeah. Oh, it's a car that invites in you to relax yes. and Need it's the whole. Uh, Take me for a ride. The whole philosophy of this car was that driving around should be a nice experience, and you shouldn't feel like you're in a hurry or that you might suddenly encounter a racetrack. <laughs> There's no sense of urgency, which is nice, which is, you know, well suited to the actual performance of the car. Yeah. I got second that yeah, time. Nice thing, yeah. Yeah. Looking in the rearview mirror and all I can see is Frankers. Oh yeah, the mirror's a bit of a thing. Yeah. A bit of a thing. Honestly, this car is every bit as smooth or actually more so than, than my Volvo. Like I don't feel oh, sure. any of No, the, there's no pattern. It's just like no. sliding it, it along. It irons all that right? shit out. Yeah. It's amazing. They made a million and a half of these cars in 20 years. Went Oddly almost enough, unchanged for their entire production. How many came to North America though? Because you just don't oh, see. Oh, not very many. You don't see Citroëns uh, over here. They you did not. Don't. They were not successful here at all for a million reasons. Very few dealers. Nobody could work on them. I you can't need, imagine why. You need a whole different set of tools, right? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's not that they're so much difficult to work on. It's just that everything you know. It's like the rest of the car everything you know about other cars does not apply yes so you have to start again as a mechanic and so most mechanics just said no it's like this dichotomy of like ridiculous complicated nonsense and serenity and comfort and bliss right it was bought by people who had a completely different understanding of what they wanted in a car and generally those people did not work on their own cars. No. It was, so you have the unfortunate combination of a car that is a very high maintenance car, generally bought by people who did not do their own maintenance. Do you know how much warranty these had when they were new? Half an hour. <laughs> Close, 90 days. 90 days, same thing, yeah. 90 days, yeah. when Chrysler offered five year 50,000, Citroen offered 90 days, <laughs> and then you're effed. Yeah. Then yeah. you're on your own. You're on your own. Overall, though, like I never get into this car expecting to, to have to get a tow truck to get home. I never do. And the engine that's itself is tire. really, yeah. really good. The, the tires, that's my fault. Occasionally, you've called your sister the, to come Occasionally, in. I've had to get bailed out when I'm riding out my 50-year-old tires. It's a little boaty. It's yeah, roly-poly, for sure. Little, yeah. But this is definitely the nicest riding of all your cars. I think that I probably the nicest riding of any car. Oops, go forth. <laughs> what were you saying about Jeez. mastering the gearbox? Yeah, see, I did. It's just I did it in a very French way. It's just like, <laughs> go first, fourth, second, third. Fourth, yeah, it's got then. its own pattern. Yeah. Yeah. Vash. Oh, vash. Hey, vash. Nice. Oh, hey. So. Oh, those Third nice ones, eh? Right? Vash. Look at that. That's a beauty. It's even a cement, a cement, a cement. Huh? It's a cow. Uh, a question. Hmm. Qu'est-ce que c'est? Pourquoi? Oh, <laughs> yeah, je ne comprends that. Uh, I don't know, I've never been able to. Like, if you move the things around enough, sometimes it gets warmer or colder. makes you feel more French. I feel 
more French. Just slightly more French. Just slightly more French. There's mules. There's two mules. Two mules. Two mules and a... Two mules for Sister Laura. Wasn't that a movie? Yeah. I know. Are you starting to get used to it? Okay. Yeah. I've been called worse. Whoa! That was Citroën's other model, was De Chevaux, which is two horses. How bad was that? That was. Uh, actually, it had 14 horsepower. What? That's the one that Bruce has. Pardon? 14. Yeah. But it was called the dish of oak to sell it to farmers. With more, with more. Oh yeah, I got a lawnmower with more. Yeah. Uh, merci. This is all you can really do in this car, Scott. I'm not gonna lie. Like you can't drive this car anywhere except on beautiful fall days and just like yeah. just be serene. You can't do anything. Like you couldn't drive this car in traffic. I don't know how you do it. Lemon ass, you're doing good today? What a nice girl. like the most French thing. Like, they're, what's more French than a DS? Of course. Like, I don't think anything is. Best Maybe the Eiffel, you'd have to actually have your own Eiffel Tower to have more of a oh. French icon than this. Rangers, can you check and see if there's any cars? See if there's us? anybody behind us, Rangers. Yeah. No. Because I can. Why are the brakes so good in this car? Like, what's, what is it? Why do oh. I have a mushroom and not a brake pedal? No, the idea was that the car had already a high-pressure hydraulic system uh, installed in it, so why not use that to provide the pressure for the brakes? And, okay. and then they built these huge airplane-sized brake calipers because disc brakes were entirely new technology, so they put these huge, huge rotors, big vented rotors, huge calipers, and then they, so the pedal, the mushroom thing, is really just a valve. So you're opening the valve, and that's allowing the car's system pressure to apply the brake for you. So you're really only pushing a little tiny spring that is there to return the valve to normal. Why did they have a hydraulic system? What the hell is like, with the Oh, it was, uh, it was, uh, why? Is that was just, I think it was just, just it was a case was of a because they could. Yeah, yeah, I think they had learned a lot about hydraulics during the Second World War. You had a lot of great engineers and they had a few very ambitious ones get together and they basically designed this system. The idea was to make the best car in the world. Right. And the, it really, in, in a sense, is the first car that is substantially different from the Model T. But most cars then went back to that same format. Oh yeah. The trouble with this suspension is instead of a coil spring that takes five seconds for a machine to make, you've got probably... Blue the vash! Anyway, <laughs> you've got uh, probably a hundred highly toleranced parts, like within less than half a thousandth of an inch. And that all takes gigantic machining time. Right, right. So just the, the sheer expense like this car cost as much as a Cadillac when it was new, but Cadillac had like 500 horsepower and power everything, and this thing was still a column shift four cylinder pushrod car, and you had to roll your own windows down. The whole car 
is really to designed to show off the French suspension. engineering yeah. of the suspension, this, which is, so it's, it's the beautiful. best part of the car. It's yeah, beautiful. it makes it such a lovely car to drive. Yeah, it's absolutely because you you kind of forgive it the rest of the stuff because honestly, I it, to me it's the closest thing to a living thing that's ever been had an engine put in it like well, you can, it's you like can a pet it just wants to make you comfy yeah and happy and make you feel french it wants you to feel good which is the exact opposite of everything else in the world the demographic that that it was designed for didn't really exist fava beans you know what goes well with fava beans uh. a nice chianti Lamb fell asleep. <laughs> well, we made it back. We made it back, and I love it. How the hell do you get out of it? Like, there's there's a little button here. It doesn't do anything. This is well, the window, right here. This is the window. Yeah. Are we duked you hazarding can, you out? Can, you do can we get that. do you we do one of these? Yeah. I'm totally. I'm not gonna do that on camera, but. Is there something on the dash? No, there's... Do I have to press the clutch? Does the mushroom of. have something to do with it? Oh, 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 oh. You did it, yeah, you pass. I passed. You're one of very tiny number of people who ever actually got out of the car without instructions. That is outstanding. I enjoyed the car. And so it's time to decompress with a little bit of uh, the finest wine that we could find on the side of the road today, in a bag. Its shape is unlike any car I've ever seen. Yes, this car is actually eight inches narrower at the back wheels than the front. Look at the pokey things on the front. Those are, uh, those are the bumper bumpers. The bumper bumpers, so that's like parking in France? Yeah, bonk these are shit, like bonk shit. Bonk Sorry, shit bonk sure regret. They had to stop importing these cars to North America when the bumper standards came out with the big ugly bumpers in the mid 70s. Citroën just said, "We're not putting those on our cars, so fuck you." As I get that would. impression. I get that impression. There was a lot of their uh, policies yeah. were, yeah. ah, fuck you guys. <laughs> hey, the signal lights should cancel. Ah, fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> The transmission, other than having four fourth gears, was yeah. lovely. It is lovely. Brakes were pretty amazing in this car. I have nothing to complain about with brakes. Transmission, other than my terrible driver's error, it was, uh, it was, it was amazing. I enjoyed it. It needed a wine holder and a baguette holder and another 100 horsepower maybe 200 horsepower. But other than that... Other than those minor niggles... Niggles? That's a significant foot. On you know side. what's funny about how long the hood is? You know where the engine is? Right there. What's under here then? What's That's this? all the transmission and the hydraulics and the brakes and the spare tire and the extra beer storage and the horns and the headlights. The actual engine starts about here oh. and it goes to there. So it does have baguette storage? They're so good and okay unmaintained this is an abused kind of poor example 50 years old i've never had to add oil like you have to change it before you have to add it does not use a drop of oil uses a few drops of whatever else but really why, why are they not still all on the road rust these things were made out of very thin steel and they rusted away the hoods are beautiful. That's a single sheet of uh, aircraft grade aluminum. It weighs almost nothing. Well, I'm seeing your dog eating your croissants. Hey! What? Are you eating the croissants? Maybe. Get out of there. But I think she's finished. Okay, well, lots of, uh, lots of discussion. Uh, Laura can hit me, hit me with the runners up here. Innovant. Innovant, I'm going to guess that means new and innovative. Innovative. It was innovative. I would say that's a very good word. Incredibly for, for its time. Innovative. I like the fact that they just said, screw all of you who are making our own car, and they slammed the door and they just came up with this. Yeah. Um, no, they really did. They 
They read all the how to make a car books so they knew what they weren't going to do. Yep. Uh, okay, Innovant, very good, very good runner upward. You have another one. Another possibility was L'Avenir. Kind of I don't know what that one means. Up and coming. Future. Uh, the future. The future. The future. Avenue. That's very good. I've always described this car as the future we were promised rather than the shit one we actually got. Tas Demi Plain kind of guy over here. I don't know. <laughs> Took me a while to translate that. <laughs> My Google Translate is a bit shabby. <laughs> a but little rusty. A um, little rusty. That's another. Is that the yeah. word you chose? Slightly <laughs> rusty. And All right. Some caviar. After a bottomless string of French cliches. <laughs> Arrivé à un mot. One word for the car. Singuli sing. Singulier. I think that's uh, I think that describes the car. A one and only. It's not really a one and only because they they obviously made millions of these, but as I said, they just they just did it on their own. When you get in it airs up. And just goes. I mean, that's outstanding. Yeah, totally not was, necessary, uh, but super cool. And I think this word describes it. There's a lot of things on this car yeah. that were never done on any other car. Yep. Not just the suspension. The, the speedometer has the stopping distance on there in case you're driving along and you're like, can I stop before I hit that tree? No. Nope. Well, let's have a quick look at the speedo. Start, then. I'm Looks just like keep I need going. 80 meters. Hmm. <laughs> well, it looks like we're going to hit it. <laughs> the tea platter of warning lights with a big stop in the center. Never that seen on any other car. my favorite part of the car. I noticed it immediately. The one spoke steering wheel, only car, singular spoke. Hiding the how to get the hell out of the car button. Um, the the door handles the door are handles. absolutely a nightmare. We're not talking about stuff that Citroen did first, but stuff that nobody ever did again. The seats are like... A foot thick. They're I found amazing. myself slouching slightly, but I think you're supposed to. You're supposed to slouch. It encourages slouching. Slouching. Well, even the whole philosophy of the car, which was everybody should be comfortable and relaxed, which seems to be the opposite of how cars are now, where everybody should be prepared that a race might break out at any second. That nobody's driving the Nurburgring to get to work. This is how you get to anywhere. So comfortable. You get so to show up and you're so relaxed. You relax. You don't hate everything. I mean, well, you hate it less, a little bit. Hey, anyway, boo -boo. no, it's a, it's a lovely car. I'm uh, very happy with that review, especially in light of some of the previous reviews, which were less than glowing. This is as close as we're going to get to a glowing review of any of my shit boxes. Join me, possibly, another day for Umo Auto reviews all right see you next time i have many cars lined up are they all french no so this is the I, last of them I've oh until up, the sm's done i've used up all my french like honest to god that's it i i have well you done. never said mr jones is going to the library monsieur jones va au bibliothèque à la bibliothèque i don't bibliothèque Ma my crayon, pen crayon. is broken Ma stilo. Mon stilo est merde. <laughs> Mon auto est bleu. bleu. Oh, My car is blue. Thank you. Thank you, grade 7. Yeah. Oddly enough, still use grade 7 math. Grade 7 French, not very useful. Still get kicked out of any actual French speaking uh, you get gathering. Kicked out a lot of I get places, kicked out of most so places, so I don't give a shit. English or German English or, or otherwise. Or I get kicked out of more English speaking places as it would turn out. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching the show this week. I hope you enjoyed it as much as uh, we did putting it together. If you uh, do like this kind of thing, please hit the old like button. It helps the show get seen. And please subscribe and please double check if you think you're subscribed. Uh, also, thanks very much for, for all the comments. Uh, please feel free to leave a comment. I do enjoy reading them all and it does help the video get seen. So yeah, thanks very much. And we will talk to everybody very soon. This is a regular ah, Same old shit.
Thank <laughs> you.